The University of Providence women's basketball team is on a hot streak, winning 11 straight games with five of them being against top 25 opponents, making the Argos a top 25 basketball team themselves. Fifth-year seniors and All-Americans Emily Maldonado and Parker Essery have been shouldering the load during their stretch, with Maldonado earning back-to-back -back Frontier Conference Player of the Week awards, averaging 18 points per game, while Essery is averaging 15.4 points per game on 58% shooting from the field. Having me and Emily obviously do fifth years with Kirsten and Ellie, and we have a lot of girls who we've played together for four years, three years, and I think having that, we all get along really well and it's kind of created a great bond. Maldonado and Essary, like many seniors last year, had the chance to come back for a fifth year due to COVID-19. Many seniors across the country opted to graduate and move on past basketball, but for them, there was unfinished business. Talked about it over the off season and I didn't know what I was gonna do. I was still undecided and then towards the end, I wasn't ready to let it go. And so I think now with this, you know, season that we're having, it's, it's been nice. We talked about it. And ha having the opportunity, especially with the COVID year kind of being taken away from us, I definitely felt like there was unfinished business and I, I just kind of wasn't done yet. But that's not all, folks. Throughout this season, the pair continue to surpass milestone after milestone. Both are close to surpassing 2,000 career points in the same career span, which if done will be virtually unheard of in the NAIA or the NCAA. Essary will more than likely end up a five-time All-American, while Maldonado, a four-timer. It shows a lot. I mean, seeing both of our names up there, we came in together starting as freshmen and now finishing it with the fifth year. I think that's just the biggest opportunity that we were given, and we've had to, we were able to achieve a lot. Despite the duo's success, it's been a matter of trust that has propelled the team forward, with the team getting much-needed contributions from role players like sophomore Brooklyn Harn and junior Reed Hazard, which allowed the Argos to be holistically competitive through injuries and COVID-19 protocols. And with those, we have a lot of trust. So Coach Bill was gone. We fully trust JC and Stephanie to lead our team, and we have great leaders on the team as well that we have tr trust in. And You know, it's huge for us, and so, yeah, everybody's playing their role, and I think with that comes along our season, and I think playing for each other has made it an impact for us. The Lady Argos are back at home Thursday, January 26th, for when they square off against Montana Tech. In Great Falls, I'm Dylan Foreman, MTN Sports.